Hi, in this video I will finish the mysterious watch with ETA movement 2801 inside. In the first part of this video I will replace the crystal, I am doing this already, so that's the crystal, then later I will finish assembly of the movement and then of course I will assemble the whole watch and we will see how it is working with this disc if you didn't saw the first part after this video i invite you to see also the first part okay here i have the crystal 32 millimeter so i think this one should fit so let's go with the crystal first Okay, here should go the crystal, so I think all of you knows. Now I need to put the ring inside. Let's use some magic. And here we have the ring inside the crystal. Optical lens wipe is good to clean. I always put a little bit silicon grease around the watch case because it helps just to push the crystal inside the case with this one is not so easy I have to use a press okay and here we have it the case I think it's finished we have a new crystal so we will see everything very clearly on the end, because I have the silicon grease, I will just lubricate a little bit the gasket from the case pack. Okay, I think the case is ready. And now the winding stem, because this one was missing, so I bought a new one and this will fit and so it looks with the winding pinion and the clutch okay so let's go with the assembly of the movement what left is the keyless work it's the pellet fork and of course the balance okay a little bit lubrication and let's go very small parts here comparing for example with the Soviet watches this one are very tiny but they do the job okay now the all levers in the keyless work Okay, I need to only secure with the screw. Okay, it seems to work good. Now the wheels. This is the minute wheel. Here is also a covering plate. The 
and this is secured only with one screw. Okay, now the pellet fork. This is a very delicate part and remember we have here 28 800 bits per hour. So the pellet fork is a little bit smaller here. And we have more teeth on the on the escape wheel. Okay, now the bridge from the pellet fork. Okay, and now I have to only secure the bridge or the pellet cock. And as we see, it's working, so that's good. Here is still one screw missing. Let's screw it. Let's tighten it. And the balance wheel. That's the most important thing because that determines if we done our job good. And yeah, it's working. So. Now I have to only secure the bridge with the screw and then the balance stone. Here we have the Inca block. It's very convenient to work on it. Okay, the stone is in. Now the day. And on the day we have an Yugoslavian president from 1953 to 1980. It's Josip Broz, called also Tito. First we have to make here this hour wheel. And this is Tito. Rather, this is Dale with Tito. Marshall Tito. It's a Marshall. Okay, the Dale is in. Now I only have to secure the fits with these hooks. Locks. Exactly with this. It's always good to press a little bit the movement to the day so it fits as tight as possible. Okay. Now the hands.
now the minute hand let's check everything And before I put the second hand, I have to take out the winding stem. And this is the second hand, or rather this is a second disc. That makes the watch a little bit mysterious, or different from other watches. Okay. Few scratches already on the disc, so we have to live with that. Of course the winding stem have to be shortened, now it's only temporary. And yeah, here we have it. It's, it's really nice here made, because depending on which position is the second disc, the face of the Tito, of Marshall Tito, appears and disappears. So <laughs> this is nice by this watch. And yeah, that's the finished watch. The winding stem is already shortened. So thanks for watching. I hope you enjoy this video. I invite you to see my other videos. And I will catch you in the next one. Thank you. Take care. Bye bye. <music>